Well, when you're driving around most cities and towns, the water tower standing high above most everything not only lets you know where you are, it can also give you a feel for the place. But the water tower in West Eatonville is so weather worn, it's actually hard to spot. As West Jews Michelle Meredith reports, it is about to get a renovation that will make it a stand out like a beacon. The water tower looks like a gigantic relic you might find in an antique yard with rust so thick you can barely make out the name of the town it's standing in, Eatonville. But the old tower on the west side is in the process of getting a major facelift with a paint job and improvements so profound it will be transformed from this to this. Monday. Day one of this renovation, they're draining the water out of the tower, and they tell us this should not affect water service. And Eatonville says work on the tower will not interrupt business for companies near it. The 3D tire company practically sits in its shadow. Definitely been around since um, I was born. Um, I was born here in, ooh. I'm going to say the 70s. <laughs> <laughs> Owner Donovan Williams welcomes plans for the new look. Make Eatonville shine. Every day. <laughs> and plans to make Eatonville shine have been in the works for decades. Its status is legendary. Founded in 1887, it's considered the oldest incorporated black town in the nation. <laughs> Founded by men and women who were once slaves. And while improvements have been made, a beautiful arch proudly announcing Eatonville as the town that freedom built, a new library, landscape streets, Eatonville has struggled, a struggle that frustrates many who live here. They need to go to work on it, just like they've been renovating the rest of the area in order to bring it up to date. And it's important why because it deserves just as much respect. Respect for the town freedom built, soon with its name clearly announcing, you have arrived. In Orange County, Michelle Meredith, West 2 News. Eatonville has two water towers. The one that people are most familiar with is in the middle of the town. Eatonville says they have dual pressurizing pumps that will keep water flowing while work is being done on the west side tower.